To explain how we can deal with loneliness, I will use examples from Stoicism. Stoicism is a practical philosophy that teaches individuals how to live a good and virtuous life by focusing on personal virtue and wisdom. Some of these Stoicism's key principles are living with virtue like wisdom, courage, self-discipline and justice, understanding what we can control and what we cannot control, and indifference to external things. Stoicism is a philosophy that was founded in a moment of loneliness. Its peak were during times of sadness. Zeno of Citium. The actual founder of the philosophy Stoicism had lost everything in a shipwreck. Everything. Every one of his belongings, his wealth, his most famous work. And that made him philosophize more. Seneca, one of the well-known Stoic philosophers, his best writings that lasted ages come from when he was exiled and lonely. Marx Aurelius, one of the few good emperor philosophers, he wrote his famous meditations when he was lonely, isolated or in war. All these philosophers knew and wrote that in times of loneliness, you are the only only one you have. So you have to be a better friend to yourself. Let's not say have, but you get to be a better friend for yourself. Because you will never cure your loneliness fully if you do not start to accept yourself and be a better friend to yourself. Even if you are surrounded by many many people and friends. Everything starts with you. You don't feel good about yourself. So you isolate yourself from people because you do not feel good about yourself. And you're away from people. This is an unending cycle. That happens to millions of people, maybe even you. You can end this cycle if you intentionally break it. Just like Cleantes, in times of loneliness, say to yourself, you are not talking to a bad person. If you start to treat yourself right, you will be treated right. And this brings us to my second point, express love feel love. One of the few things you have actual control over is the energy you put out in the world. You need to give what you want. It can be giving it to yourself or to other people. Marx Aurelius says, if you want to feel good, do good. If you want to feel loved, love. But you are never ever truly lonely and by yourself. Right around the corner, there is always someone or something that is willing to listen to you. Always. We feel loneliness not because in reality we are actually lonely, it's because we suffer in our minds. Just reaching out to that one person will help you so much. Trust me, there is always that one friend who is willing to talk to you. There is always that one family member, maybe miles apart from you, that is willing to listen to you. The only thing you need to do is to have the courage to reach out. My name is Alp, thank you for watching, and never forget that happiness is achieved.